Hey guys, we're back to Risky and the Half Genie Brat. Um, <laughs> what are we doing here? Okay. These lips so, are kind of cool. Oh, Isaac, God, a bat. What? You know what I would do if you weren't allergic? What? I would make it my life goal to only adopt elderly shelter animals. Really? And I would go through the process of giving them a good last few years of their life and going through the grief of having them die just so then they can have a good last few years of their life. Huh. I know it's a lot of suffering on my end, but there's so many like animals out there that get abandoned when they're old and nobody wants them because they don't want to deal with the fucking grief like a goddamn adult. And so, wouldn't it be cool to just be the person who gets to do that for them? Yeah, it would be, actually. Or, like, get, like, I like the that really, idea. like, disabled animals or, like, the little, like, ones with the nubbin legs. Because no one adopts those ones because they're just odd-looking and have more medical complications. And it's like, you know what? I'm just going to spend my extra money dealing with this animal's medical complications so they can be happy and not abandoned. And that's what I want to do if you weren't allergic to everything. Well, that, that's the problem there. Well, hasn't your allergies gotten better over the years? Yeah, in general, yes. I don't have nearly as many allergy problems as I used to. The only thing that really sets them off now still are cats. Um, just cats make, make, like, I'm fine in the presence of cats, but if they touch me at all, like they yeah. come up to me and start rubbing against me, then I just, oh my, I'm a, then I'm a mess. So, no cats. We could get, like, little, like, nubbin, nubbin like, dogs and old doggies. Can we do that? Sure. I want an old Cuz yeah, dogs don't doggy. Dogs don't bother me nearly as much as far as allergies go. As long as they don't like fly over your like face and stuff like certain puppies do. I guess. I, even then like it's still not as bad as cats. Yeah. It's never it's never been as bad and it's gotten better. That kind of sucks cuz you're more of like a cat person. I am more of a cat person. I'm more of a dog person to be honest. But I love cats a lot too. It's just Oh god. Hi, Glorpy. I think the best way for me to deal with them is like hit them once and then run, because then they, the, after I yeah. hit them once, they'll be on guard for a while, so they won't be focused on me. Yeah. Now, what are you saying? Yeah, I'm more of a cat person. I am. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I like both cats and dogs, but um, I don't know. I'm just so like into my own thing anyway. I feel like dogs need more attention, and they, they, they they're clingers. Yeah, and I'm just. See, I already have you. I don't need anything <laughs> anything more clingy than that in my life. Am I the only clingy thing you need in your life? Uh, you're plenty on your own. <laughs> see, that's why we need a dog. So that you have something we'll to cling, cling to. Together. That's not me. Yeah, okay. We'll, we'll be bonding clingy. You know, even in Shantae, I never figured out how to get those jars down there. Oh, yeah. Hey, is the... I was going to say, is the snake charmer lady still here? But I don't see her. Because I, I guess there'd be no point to her in this. I don't think I can get up here without cannonballs. Even even best hat probably wouldn't be able to do that. Oh, we have the slide section is risky now. That'll nice. be different, maybe? It might just be exactly the same. I also realized my entire family's a bunch of dog people. Actually, um, I don't know why it was making me think of this, but um, I have a co-worker, one of the other music teachers I work with, who, uh, haha, <laughs> hat, cheating, um... <laughs> Uh, and she left our district for a year because she wanted to take up a different position doing like middle school music instead of elementary school music because that's what I do is I specialize in elementary school music and um, when I was working with her before she um, had recently taken on um, a foster child oh cool um, and so she had a foster child uh, since then because now she's back with our district uh she has taken on four more. Oh, wow. She has five kids at her house. Wow. Ranging from, I believe, like, seven to 14. If you like kids, and I mean, if you want to go down the foster parent route, you start, end up collecting a lot of kids. So. <laughs> That's a very common thing, you know, if you're a foster parent. I've, I, I've always thought I'd like to foster parent if I couldn't have kids of my own. I think that's what we've talked about before, where it's yeah. like if there was ever, like if we either get too old to have kids or there's a medical reason why we can't have kids, like 
right? Because because we become foster. Because we have not we've we've thought about having kids, but we've not thought of it anytime soon. No, it's just it's something that's not even on the table for us right now, and we and we why we, we wouldn't seriously consider it yet. Well, we're also like way we're still a bit young to be thinking about that. Like I'm well, three. I guess, but I mean, there's a lot of people who have kids when they're you know younger than that. Yeah, uh, it's just it's just not something we want to do yet. But I don't know. Maybe by the time we're ready, we might be too old. <laughs> we'll see. Yeah. How dare that Technomoron attempt to block my efforts? No one defies me! I'll wring his think neck if he has one. Because mm-hmm. he doesn't really, he just has a kind of a... Yeah. He just kind of has a, like a mouth. Yeah. A sharp mouth. So do I have to fight the mermaid boss? I'm assuming know. so. You there, get lost. I just got production back on track will not tolerate further distractions. So this is right after Shante beat him, is what they're saying. Well, it's sometime after that, because we've already seen Nega Shante. Ugh. Listen up, you little creep! I know you've got the part I need! Hand it over if you know what's good for you! No one speaks to Techno Baron in this matter. No one! Tisk tisk! We can do this the easy way, or the teeth to tail slicing torso gutting sloppy way! I- I'm not sure if you're being violent or sexual. <laughs> I like the cut of your jib, Queen of the Seven Seas, is it? Well, turns out my sea queen is a whole lot bigger than yours. But don't take my word for it. See for yourself. Why would you be defending him? Yeah, here you go. It's, uh, it's a mermaid. <laughs> <laughs> uh, she remember, captured him again. Do you remember how much trouble this boss gave me before? Yeah. But before I had no healing items. Here I got like a tuna roll and like a lot more. Tuna rolls are the best healing of items. It says she was recaptured. I mean, a lot of this is just kind of, you know... All for the sake of giving Risky her own mode. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's like it's all kind of like, well, that doesn't make sense. How would she let herself get captured again? But it doesn't she matter. Was sleepy. You 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 suspend that. You know what I mean? There's a lot of suspension of disbelief. Yeah, and there's a. I think that's especially true in games. You have to be willing to get suspension of disbelief because most things are for the sake of making a fun game. You know what I mean? It doesn't always have to have you know the greatest, most coherent story of all time, as long as it's fun to play. Because if it's not fun to play, well, then the if the story sucks, well, you're fucking screwed. Right. And your game is shit. So, I mean, does it really make much story sense for the mermaid to get captured again? Not really, but do I care? Maybe she's no. just a terrible, like, klutz or ditz or something and can easily get captured. It's a part of her character. I'm being a lot more reckless since I have so many healing items. And so she's more, like, pissed off at herself than she is at the guy who captured her. Ah, I was hoping I could float all the way. I can't. My hat's not that good yet. Uh, I'm, being, I'm being a lot more I'm being riskier uh, than I was with Shanti in this fight because it's I, risky I have, mode well, because, because <laughs> I have more healing items because she has a second phase too don't forget oh yeah they all have it multiple phases holy crappers I don't think there were that many when I fought with Shanti uh, it's hard when there's only one lock left. You know what I mean? Like, when there's other locks, you're like, well, I can just uh, dodge, focus on dodging and go to one of the other locks for now. But there are no other other locks for now. I already did them all. Mmm. Mmm. That, that was great. Let me have some more juicy melons. Melons are the best. Melons all the way. There's a lot of juicy melons in this game, if you, if you catch my drift. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there are. <laughs> Cool. I just took the hits and got up here. It's just, it's worth it when you have so many healing items anyway. <laughs> no, she's like, oh! Time for phase two, right? Shouldn't she just be happy I freed her? No. No. I'm still angry. Okay. I better eat right away. But I still have ten. Oh, yeah, that's right. I remember this now. Oh, and then I have to climb up and clonk her in the head, I think. Yeah. Clonk her in the. Whoa, face. she did not give me very much time. But I can kind of. I think I can kind of cheese it a little bit by floating. I just got to be careful still about. Okay, this stuff. Oh, what if I just. Can I just. Oh, I can just shoot her! Oh, fuck! Just, just do this then! This is way easier with Risky! Oh god. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> oh my god. The 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 homing missiles make this way easier. 
<laughs> oh shit! <laughs> I mean, it's only a difference of two power. I'm hitting way more consecutive times than I would be with the sword. I've only got ten rockets left, but then I can still just spread shot and, like, focus it. Oh, man. I gotta be not be so reckless with this. Not be so risky. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, that was bad. That was pretty risky. <laughs> oh, those only do two. <laughs> oh, come on. Be done already. You're only the second boss. The music's the same. They didn't change the music, but that's fine. I mean, it's the same game. So, it's still good. Okay, I might try sorting. It's just doing two damage at a time. It just feels like I'm wasting my spread shots. I might as well use them during those instances, because I have no way of getting up anyway, but it might be worth me to try to sort. I don't know, maybe not. It's so hard to reach her. She's just too tall. But I only got ten shots left anyway. So, at best, that's going to be twenty damage. And I don't know how much health she has left. It's annoying when enemies don't have a health bar. Yeah, I guess so. I mean, some games do and some games don't. Yeah, it's a pet peeve for me, though. Is it? Mm hmm I guess, are you just used to playing games where they always have health bars? Yeah. I just like knowing how far I Oh, there we go! It, perf it, it perfectly took all my special weapons. I'm fine with that. That's what the weapons are for, boss battles. Exactly! Bosses. So wow, the homing missiles make that fight really easy. Oh, we don't see the rescued uh, mermaid this time. I am I Risky Boots, Queen of the Seven Seas! Know your place, worm, or next time I'll make boots out of your hide and mount your giant fish friend on my wall! Got it? Got it? Yes, ma'am. Yes, All right. Oh, Jesus! Oh. You didn't address me by my proper title. Oh, there's Happy Mermaid. Hi. Thanks for saving me. You look kind of evil, though. Yeah, what do you want, fish face? <laughs> Don't look at me like that. I'm a bad guy. But I want to kiss you. Don't think for a second that I helped you on porpoise. But, but. Did, but did you get Did yes, you get the pun? Yes. <laughs> purpose. Ah, never mind. In any case, you owe me one. Got that? Oh, that's a lot of work, I suppose. Thank you. Yeah, she is looking at me very longingly. Yeah, I guess she Okay, likes. now she's just looking at <laughs> That's treasure. a nice treasure chest. <laughs> I'll make it into my dildo. What? <laughs> what? It's not even shaped like... Shh. Okay. Shh. It'll work. No, it won't. It's Excellent! Well. With this component in hand, I'll be able to make the dynamo even stronger! Mm, is this for me? Another power up? Grappling hook? Grappling gun! Well, you said gun. That's different than what it's. Whatever. Consistency! Grapple up to hard to reach locations. Once attaching, crawl along ceilings too. I wonder how it works. Dreadful. Now, stop fooling around and man your stations. No! There's a lot more voice acting in this. I think, think Christina actually liked Risky way more. The Mermaid Factory Hut's mysterious cave. I'll need to find somebody to get up there. Oh, so it's kind of like a replacement for the spider mode. Hmm. hmm. Well, I guess I'll go ahead and try that then. I, I do want to know how the thing works. So, if I want to go to the Mermaid Cave, uh, that's Area 2, right? Area 3 is the slide, I believe. Alright, well, let's see how this grappling hook works. I'm I'm really curious because that's new. That wasn't in Pirates Curse. I don't think. I don't think it was a grappling hook. No. Okay. How do I use the grappling hook? Grappling hook. Yes. How do I use it? Okay. Time to try all the buttons. Nope. 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 Yes. <laughs> it's the X. I'm playing on Wii U, so it's the X button. It's the X Files. Do you ever want to watch X Files? You know, I've been curious. I think it was on Netflix a couple years back. Because I never saw it. It's really weird. It's really weird? Yeah. In what way? Just. Um... So, okay, let's let's test it here. 
Ooh, oh, look at this! It's roly poly. That's so cool! I love it! Oh! Nice. I wasn't sure if that would work or not. I was just experimenting. That's why you experiment with these things. It's like, you know, because sometimes you're like, ah, oh, that wouldn't work, and then it does. Uh. That is cool. I, I like the grappling hook. I'm seeing I'm seeing how, how precise I can be with it. Okay. Glorpy! So I don't think I can fight the Glorpies all that well until I have the sword slam. So Assuming that's in the game. Glorpies. Well, it's the name you gave him. Oh, look at this! Oh, yeah. Boom. Yeah! Dark magic. Cool. So I can upgrade my hat again, which is totally what I'm doing. Because this thing I have no problems with. The hat is still the most annoying thing. <laughs> I want the hat to be great. I want a great hat. But you have plenty of great hats, Isaac. Yeah. You know, uh, a lot of the whole thing of, like, her, her fedoras has died down on the internet. So Thank that's, fucking that is, God. That is nice for me. <laughs> I'm like, okay. Well, I just hate when, like, something as trivial as clothing becomes, like, a symbol of something that's stupid. Oh, God! Oh! Oh, she ate you! Yeah, me too. Like, it just ruins it for everybody else who doesn't want to associate with that. It's like, but it's a cool hat! Uh, yeah, I just... I mean, I, I said, I, the whole reason I like the hat in the first place, I think I've talked about this before, the whole reason I like the hat in the first place is because there was a guy I looked up into high, in high school who wore a hat like that. And then my friend Chris, Lord Jackal, Adustus as he goes by now. Um, <laughs> oh, that's his new name now? Oh yeah, that's his new username is Adustus. Okay. Which is a type of Jackal, if I understand correctly. But in any case, um, okay. he gave me a hat like that before I left for college. Um... And so it was just kind of a, I don't know, it was for me it was, a, it was a symbolic thing. That's, yeah, a very personal thing. Um, and so I, I wore that fedora for like years. five years before the whole internet herder fedora thing started. And I was like, <laughs> well, okay, I guess, I guess my hat is, is uncool or lame or a symbol of, of, of minimus now or whatever. I don't know. I just well, kept wearing it anyway because it was already my thing. You know, I'm not the type to like, you know, stop doing the things that I like just because other people someone don't. Someone fucked it over. Yeah, someone else was like, <laughs> I love your sound effects for this. Someone show. else was like, <laughs> <laughs> What? How is that? Even I'm worse? dead. God damn it! I keep forgetting about the time on these episodes. We gotta cut off. See you guys next time. See ya.